Hey there, Dr. Sands here. I'm super excited to share with you about my new book, Six Sigma Success Factors. It's available now at Amazon.com. All you have to do is just type in the search Six Sigma Success Factors, or you can scan this QR code. But first, let me tell you a little bit about it. I'm super excited because it's been in years in the works. It first started when I was doing my PhD in management and my dissertation was on Six Sigma. So through my dissertation, I had to do a lot of quantitative research and a lot of survey data to prove uh, a hypothesis was Six Sigma projects don't fail because of Six Sigma methodology. And through all that research and statistical analyses, I was able to prove that that is the case. Six Sigma projects don't fail because of the methodology. Anyway, so I wrote my dissertation around that uh, when I was getting my PhD. And uh, for years now, I've been wanting to take all that work. And plus, I am a certified Six Sigma black belt and have a master's in it as well. And I really wanted to take uh, all my foundational research uh, all the practical work that I've done over the years. Uh, I've been doing Six Sigma since about 2008, and I really wanted to, to write a book that was, you know, uh, uh, you can learn from it. It's a practical guide. You can take this book and put it right to work for you. So on the cover here, it says a thorough exploration of Six Sigma, debunking the myths, core principles, addressing practical application and future trends. So this book is uh, 350 pages, and it is divided into six core sections. Explaining the myths surrounding Six Sigma, Six Sigma core principles, the importance of organizational engagement, the practical applications of Six Sigma, measuring the success of Six Sigma, and finally, part six is a glimpse into the future of Six Sigma. So then there's 18 chapters, like I said, broken into six core sections. So if you've never heard of Six Sigma, and you might say, well, Richard, what is Six Sigma anyways? Is it a college, college fraternity? No, it's not. Six Sigma is a set of business tools and techniques for process improvement, and it's based on a data-driven approach. And that's really one of the core principles that sets Six Sigma apart from other types of business methodologies, that it is a data-driven approach. Well, with my book, if you've never heard of Six Sigma before, you can read it, and the book ultimately will build on itself chapter to chapter. If you've been doing Six Sigma for a long time, the first few chapters might be a little bit of a, uh, a refresher, but then, like I said, each chapter starts to build on each other towards the end, and they really excite you when you look about Six Sigma and artificial intelligence. So I have a whole chapter dedicated to Six Sigma methodology and how you can use ChatGPT to um, crunch data and come up with analyses and really help out in uh, your data-driven approach. And of course, last, lastly, is the future of Six Sigma. Where, are we, where do I see Six Sigma you know, in the future? In addition to that, um, of course, there's uh, acknowledgements, a little bit about myself, introduction to the book. Um, there's an index and glossary that is very robust um a list of figures so every figure that i use is part of a methodology or a model it's uh it's listed there and then lastly is six sigma tools so the tools that i mentioned throughout the book on how to do six sigma have a whole section just dedicated to that anyways thank you for stopping by go ahead and check out my book at amazon.com today and grab yourself a copy and i hope you enjoy it thanks